Hello and good day everyone. It's the Gaming Wife and welcome back to Stardew Valley and to Paradise Farm. Today is Sandy's birthday. Now I'm going to let you guys in right now. I have restarted this day because I was all set ready to go to the Skull Cavern Mines because our luck is phenomenal. And I went to see the Desert Trader and there was an item there that I have been waiting forever for. It is the Void Pendant, which is basically like the Mermaid Pendant, but it's exclusively only for Krobus. And the reason why I really want this is because Krobus can move in with you if you have that Void Pendant. Now the Void Pendant costs 200 Void Essence to get, which is why I restarted because I didn't have any of the Void Essence on me. And I'm trying to be good with time. I'm trying to utilize my time really wisely. So, knowing that, our plan is to go see Krobus with that pendant. So, I'm going to grab... Let's see. I'll just put some stuff on here. Oh, I don't have any coal. Okay, well, let's grab all the coal. That way I got something going. I'm going to grab most of my iron so I can make lots and lots of bombs. I'm going to save about 50. There we go. Same thing with gold. Save about 50. Then I want some stone. I'm not going to have the fiber. And then I need void essence, solar essence. This is going to use up most of my void essence, which is okay. That is more than okay. I also want my bombs, my staircases. Um, going to need one of each of those. I also want my galaxy sword. Okay, I don't need the trap bobber. And then I'm going to leave one solar essence. Actually, I'm probably going to leave most of them. Because it's a one-to-one -one ratio for making the Mega Bombs. Alright, what else? Miner's Treat plus three mining. But if I take this, I can't have the buffs like Spicy Eel and Pepper Popper. Or um, Spicy Eel and Triple Shot. So I'd rather have the speed. Okay, let me grab that. Grab that. I'm going to put my seeds in here. And then because today is Sandy's birthday, I want the best quality item I can get for her. Now, she does like sweet pea. She also likes daffodil and crocus. And I happen to have a gold star crocus. So I'm going to give her that instead. I'm going to put my star fruit away. And then I also want to put my tools away that I'm not going to use. So this, 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 this. I'm going to try dual wielding again. Sandy's shop opens up at 9, but I do want to try to get there early if possible. Um, let's see, what else? Got the crocus flower. Alright, let's see if we can't get some stuff going. What else do I want to can? What else do I want to preserve? That works. There we go. Perfect. All right, and then, whoops, that's a spring one. No, that's gold. <laughs> All right. Do we have everything? 
Got enough Void Essence. Got that. Alright, I think we're ready. Okay. Triple Shot Espresso, and then... The Void Ghost Pendant. It's a symbolic to the Shadow People. As a gift, it signalizes... Signifies the desire to move in together as friends. Yes. I had been waiting forever for that to show up. Because now we can see Krobus moving in with us. And I cannot wait. So excited. Alright, so 9 o'clock is when... 9 o'clock is when the um, shop opens up. I'm going to grab all this. I'm going to head back home. We're going to go see Krobus, give him the pendant. Then we're going to head back to Skull Caverns. Okay, now... Where's my... There it is. We're being quick here. We're being quick. As quick as we can, anyways. Stardew Valley Fair is happening tomorrow. Okay, well, I'm sure I could find something to give up. Alright. Drop all that off. Yes. Let's go see Krobus. We'll take Shadow with us. I know I'm wasting time by not going down into the Skull Caverns, but that's okay. Because I really want to see this. I've never had this option before to be able to move in with Krobus. And I really want to see it before we actually get married. A void ghost pendant? How did you... Oh, wow! Lily? Yes, I'll come live with you if you like, but we have to keep it secret from everyone. I'll be at your house in a few days, okay? Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> that is so awesome. Oh, if I was smart, I would have grabbed a desert totem from this point. Darn it. That's okay. Go home. That is so cool. Okay. There we go. Nine o'clock. Perfect timing. Yes. Give the crocus to Sandy. No. Yay! Look at that. She's fully maxed out now. I heard it's raining. Is that why you came here? Sure is. Okay, now. We're going to keep this right here. What do I have on? Okay. Luck and light and radius. Perfect. Combined ring coffee and damage from slimes. Okay, that one's pretty decent. Now. Um, Make sure I got all my bombs going. All right. I don't want to have the bombs on me. We're going to try dual wielding. See how that works. And we're just going to go as far as we can. Get as much iridium as we can. Um, and do this on infested levels. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Okay, so this is not working out as... I'm trying to remember how to dual wield again. There we go. Okay. I got my speed. The goal is to try to get as far down as possible. And if we don't get as quickly as we want, we use a staircase. Like that.
All right. What did we end up getting with? 128 iridium ore. Not bad, considering the fact that I wasn't actually aiming for a skull cavern run when I first woke up this morning. So not too bad. Not too bad at all. Uh, let's see. This iridium... All right. I'll keep the two regular rabbit's feet, and I'll sell the iridium. Um... I just made a seed maker. That's a problem. And I don't need this one. I wonder if I could sell it. We'll see. Uh, let's see. What else? Well, I mean, we got we got some goodies. Got another prismatic shard. Apple sapling. I might... I might put that in my... My greenhouse. Alright. I think I got another miner's treat. Got some more solar essences and void essence, which is good. Um, let's go ahead and get this going. And I'll get an Omni Geo going. Why not? Put all that in here. And it looks like I need to head home. I need to head home. Got lots of coffee. That was quite nice. Uh, and I can make a couple more pepper poppers. One more pepper popper. I am running quite low on my sashimi. So I'm going to need to get some more fishing going for that. There we go. Not too bad. Not too bad for an impromptu mining session. Oh, and I forgot to sell a lot of stuff. So this is what? Row? Yeah, just the row. Eh, not too bad, though. Alright. But that's gonna be it for me for this episode. If you did enjoy it, do hit that subscribe button. And the like button. And if you have any comments, suggestions, or feedback, leave it in the comments section below. Thank you, everybody, for your, for your constant um, feedback and support over the course of the past few months especially during my uh my healing time i do appreciate it and i look forward to seeing you guys in the next episode thank you